So we're just practicing this, handling them both at the same time, as if you're handling one big dog with eight legs, eight feet, okay, and two heads. And I'm just taking them straight out of their crates. So they're super excited because I wanted to show you this at the most difficult time and we've got people, why don't you show Darian standing there and then show me, sit. They haven't seen Darian for a few days and they like him a lot and so they came straight out of their crates, they're excited to be out. You got somebody across the yard they want to say hi to and they still sat at the front door and it just takes a little bit of wrangling with the leash and just managing it if you haven't done this before. Okay, and then you might want to try practicing walking them like this. And even, I've never done this before at my house, so even in the beginning, see if one gets behind, you just take the individual leash and just control them so that they're back to where they're supposed to be. Sit. Good. And practice your regular sit stay stuff where you have them sit, step away from them, walk around them. At the very least, it's kind of a cool little exercise to practice in the privacy of your backyard that's fenced where there's no distractions. For them to be on the spot in good, good training form, no next to each other like this with not the most ideal of, uh, you know, leash control. Okay, just practice walking like this, calmly, without pulling, next to you, and your commands. Down. <laughs> Little things will happen like microphones getting stuck. And if they can do this side by side, well, they're really going to be good on their own when you're only dealing with one at a time. <clears throat> good. Okay. So let me try something else here. Let's try releasing them. Sit. Go. They're free. Oh, they want to go say hi to Darian, but I'm not going to let them. So they're free. Maybe I will let them. And then I'll call them back to come to me. Go ahead and pet them. Good. Look, he wants to pet you. Go look. look. Good. So good. come. See how I'm calling them back to me? Good. Very good. They both get a little treat there. Sit. Hey, pretty good. So just take a little practice with you just learning how to manage two leashes at once. And uh, I've never done this before with these guys, so, um, or really with any, any puppies before, but it's kind of a cool little thing to do. After you're finished with all your other training and they both know everything really well individually, just try doing this in, in your house or in your yard where there's no distractions. Because if you can't do this where there's no distractions, then you sure can't do it out on the street, so make sure you can do this kind of stuff, okay, comfortably, just in the privacy of your own space before you take it out into public. Come on, bud, come on. Sit. Good. Go, go play. Go on, go, go, go. Come on, over here, come on. Very good.